Residents in one Wabash Valley community may see far fewer volunteer firefighters at the next emergency. That's because more than 75% say they have resigned over a personnel matter. News 10's Dan Klein has more. It's all quiet at the Poland Volunteer Fire Department, but at the next emergency, there will be far fewer volunteers responding. It's just gotten to the point that, that the firemen couldn't handle it anymore, and myself, um, I just couldn't, couldn't uh, take it anymore. All because of former Assistant Chief Brad Allen, seen here in this file video. Firefighters who have since resigned say Allen had a negative attitude and made derogatory comments to other firefighters. In a public meeting of the Fire Protection Board in late January, several female members claimed Allen had sexually harassed them. Allen then resigned as a firefighter and as a board member, but was brought back on the board March 9th. That's when Chief Frank resigned. I would work directly with the board and, and the individual, and uh, yeah, it could cause a lot of conflict. Frank says he had no idea 17 firefighters and five more members would resign in protest, leaving, by their count, just three firefighters for the entire department. I'm putting my life in somebody else's hands, and they're putting their lives in mine. It's a trust issue. We feel we can no longer trust the board. If they're going to do this, what are they going to do next? Current firefighter and board member Craig Neese declined to be interviewed. However, he said the department is operational and has eight volunteers. He says he has only received 11 written resignations from firefighters. He says the board attorney will be looking into the policy for sexual harassment, but was not sure if the board would look into the allegations of Allen's past. For now, he would just say, quote, we are confident for the short term that we can handle things in a professional manner, end quote. As for the resigned firefighters, they hope they can at some point return here, but only if Allen is gone. The situation should have never gone this far, and I hope that it can be resolved. Reporting in Poland, Dan Klein, News 10. News 10 has left repeated messages on Brad Allen's cell phone. They have not been returned.